this is to Fiona Robertson. You'll have heard some of the comments in previous evidence sessions where they've commented about the accreditation function yes. remaining within the Qualification yeah. Scotland. What's your response to those, those comments? Ultimately, it is a choice. It is a choice whether the, the um, accreditation and regulatory function of the new organisation remains within Qualification Scotland as it, as it is within, within uh, SQA or not. Um, the, the, the government has set out its reasons for, for it re remaining within one organisation and with, w remaining within the new qualifications body, but it is a choice. Um, I mean, I think it's interesting. I mean, the policy memoranda to the bill, and, and, I, and I would cite paragraph um, 133 in particular, um, does actually highlight that, that no significant concerns were raised in relation to this issue at the time that the bill was drafted. Um, I, I think it has... I, 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 I accept that the, the original um, recommendation from Ken Muir was around that separation, but there are important issues here of function and form. Um, there are issues here in relation to what the accreditation and regulation function of the qualifications body does. That's first, the first thing. And its scope. And I am certainly keen that the scope of the accreditation function is expanded. And then there are issues about where it sits. And I have to say I'm a fan of form following function. Um, so I think um, it is important for us to consider as a system what the scope of accreditation and regulation is, and then to consider where it sits. You've indicated that if there was an issue of public confidence, perhaps it should be separated and put into another body. And I understand your point about voluntary versus uh, another think, approach. I, think... I understand that. But you're indicating that if there is an issue of public confidence, that perhaps it could be separated. I, I think it's a slightly nuanced point. I, th I, think, I think my point is that goes back to that point about it being a choice. Yeah. Uh, I, but, but I think it needs to be informed by function. Mm -hmm. um, but the public confidence of our qualification system is precious. Um, and, and if the fact... I, I, can, I can give the, the committee assurance that accreditation works separately from awarding, but if there's a perception um, that... that there's a perception that, that that is otherwise, or there's a perception that, that, that actually the same organisation can't do that job, then, then I think there is a legitimate, uh, uh, there's a legitimate consideration around, uh, around whether separation is appropriate.